In today's video, we are reviewing SiteGround, which is in my opinion, one of the best premium WordPress and web hosting services out there. I've been using SiteGround for quite a while now. I actually host most of my premium websites on SiteGround. So that's sort of like a testament to how much I like them. And yeah, there's a reason why I choose SiteGround for my more premium websites versus some of the other hosting providers out there. So yeah, my whole goal in this video is to sort of show you guys why I use SiteGround, what the pros and cons are, the best use cases, who it makes sense for. And by the end of this video, hopefully you'll have a better idea of whether or not you want to use them yourself. If you guys do want to use SiteGround, we do have a link down below. You guys can help support the channel by using that link at no additional cost to you. So thank you so much in advance. But yeah, in the sea of web hosting services out there, SiteGround stands out as a great blend of price, functionality, as well as speed. So the first thing I really like about their hosting service is that they have plans for everyone. So if you guys click on the link down below, we can actually check out the pricing. And so if I click start now, we can see some of their plans. So they have the startup plan, which is $2.99 a month. We have the grow big plan, which is $4.99 a month. And then we have the go geek plan, which is $7.99 a month. I'm actually on the go geek plan myself, but for most people, the startup and the grow big should be good enough. The only difference between these is that the startup plan, you can only host one website. So if you're trying to build multiple websites, then maybe this is not the best plan for you. If you want to actually build multiple websites with this premium hosting service, then go with the grow big or the go geek plan. I think if you're trying to build a website for your business and you're expecting a good amount of traffic, the GoGeek plan is going to be the better choice. But then again, it's very hard to get 100,000 visits monthly on a website and 20 gigabytes of web space is plenty. So for most of you guys, this should be good enough. But yeah, with the premium price tag of SiteGround, you guys can see it comes with a lot of things included. Even the cheapest plan comes with a ton of stuff, including free SSL, free email and unmetered traffic. I will say that these plans do not come with a free custom domain name, which is worth about eight to $10 per month. A lot of other ones do come with these but then again, those are more targeted towards beginners and they pretty much just probably assume that you already have a domain name. Now, a really great thing about SiteGround is that their support is amazing. It's available 24 seven. And every time that I've contacted them on live chat, they have been really quick to respond and they pretty much sort out all the issues really fast. So yeah, you're paying a more premium price tag, but you're getting premium service. And guys, $7.99 a month is not even expensive, especially if you're building multiple websites. Their uptime is also near perfect. They actually guarantee a 99.9% .9 uptime and if they don't meet that, then they actually give you free web hosting. But yeah, there's basically zero chance they'll ever fall below that. So if you want a really reliable host with near perfect uptime, 99.99%, then SiteGround is a great choice. So this is the dashboard for my SiteGround account. I just sort of want to show you guys what it looks like. But here you can see the different websites that you are hosting using SiteGround. Here you can see what plan you are on. So as you guys can see, I'm on the GoGeek plan. Here are going to be your domains that are connected. And you can even do email marketing within SiteGround. They also have a ton ton of different cool blog posts that can basically teach you a bunch of different things. And of course, SiteGround has a bunch of different services. So if you come here to their marketplace, they have web hosting, they have WordPress hosting, they have WooCommerce hosting, also cloud hosting if you want a really high performing website. And they have a bunch of these add-ons that you can get as well. If you already have another WordPress website and you want to sort of migrate that to SiteGround, SiteGround does come with a free migration software. So it's basically a plugin that does all the work for you and it works really well. Now, some things that I don't like is that the renewal rates are quite quite expensive. That's why I just recommend locking in the pricing for a longer term. Yes, you'll pay more upfront, but you will get that same low price for longer. That way you won't really have to worry about renewals for quite some time. They also have 30 and 14 day money back guarantees. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about SiteGround. I really like SiteGround. I've really enjoyed hosting my websites using them. Feel free, use the links down below, learn more about SiteGround on their website. They have a ton of information about their services and their features. And yeah, overall, I really recommend it. I can't say enough good things about them. And so if you are a premium user that's looking for really great web hosting for your business website, then I would highly recommend SiteGround. If you're doing personal websites and things like that, which don't get much traffic, then likely you don't need to splurge on the more premium pricing for SiteGround. There are other hosting services out there that are cheaper that should work plenty well for you. So for example, Hostinger, that's also one of my favorites. Not as premium, not as many features, but every plan does come with a free custom domain and with a premium plan, which is under $3 per month and even cheaper cheaper if you guys use code Charlie Chang. You can also build up to a hundred different websites. But yeah, that's it for this review of SiteGround. Overall, I highly recommend them. And if you do want to support the channel, feel free to use the link down below. We do receive a small commission if you use that link and it helps us create more free videos just like this. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe for more content just like this. This whole channel is dedicated at helping you guys build your business. Thank you so much for your time and I'll see you in the next video.